Hello, Miss Jennifer. Hello, Miss Shelley here. We are finally together in one video. For a little escapade we had yesterday, uh, where I did my drive find bagging, um, we went to our studios and we used the supplies that were given to us, kind of in the chopped inspired fashion. And today is the day we get to see what each other made. You'll see in this following clip the items that Miss Jennifer put in my bag for me to use. She was so nice to me. trying to get creative and using everything including things that were not inside the bag um, but what she used to wrap the bag um so here's mine I will show it to Miss Shelley first and then I'll show it to the camera so there it is can you see it lots of shine to it lots of glitter <laughs> see? and then kind of a feel so do you Love it. can you see oh, too. Can, you, can you see the tab from the sardines? Oh! <laughs> that is so and then the button. Okay. And then the yarn. So I, I really try to, to be resourceful. All right, let's turn it's that right. around. You guys have already seen it in the previous video, but there it is again. All right, Michelle, it's all you. Hey. You ready? Yes. So excited. Oh, oh. oh my goodness. That is so pretty. Is there that the, is. is that the tool or the fabric on the petals? Now if you can see that real well, let's see. Maybe if I get closer. Or oh yeah, I see. It. So really, all I added from my own supplies were the buttons Very and some alcohol ink that I used oh. to spray along the bottom. Oh, I like that. So Thank colorful. You. That was so much fun. Now, one of my dilemmas was the paper I had was shiny because it was photo paper. So that was an experiment to see how the gel crayons would work on there. Awesome. And um, let's see, what other? I wasn't sure if the glue was going to stick, but it it held up. I'm trying to think what the other, oh, well, what some of the other um, challenges were. One is to keep glitter from being all over me. <laughs> <laughs> That's impossible sometimes. <laughs> um, did you have any issues with yours, like dilemmas as you were doing it, things that weren't coming out the way you had hoped? You know, it first? ended up looking a little more chunky and a little more um, overwhelming. I was trying to go really simple, and it ended up not being so simple. So. <laughs> But I tried, every time there was a mistake, I tried to play with it. So when the petals started um, curling, I tried to go with it. When You know, when things like that happened, I was trying to go with it as best I could. And then it turns out looking better than you ever anticipated, I think. Yeah, I, I agree. I think it turned out pretty good. You can see, did you use the doily? Yes, um, it's hard to see. And I think if I could do one thing over again um or add to it which i guess i still can i probably would have taken the sharpies the yellow and the orange and added some color to the leaves because the doilies are on here and there's pattern and texture but there's no color to the leaves you know so we will post um clips in a video of our in process when we use all of the different items in the bag to create our masterpieces we'll also include some links to how you can create um, your flower and for those of you um, in 
or around LA County will post instructions on how you can enter your flower into the LA County Fair. Anything else to add, Michelle? If anybody we want to subscribe and like our videos, we would sure appreciate it. Absolutely. All right, with that, I think uh, class dismissed. Bye.